towards the ending of, of the game. Once upon a time, in a deep and ancient forest, crafty goblins faced the truth about the darkness in the big wooden house. It had come for the wise princess, driving her mad and causing her to attack them. When they started asking questions about the princess in the darkness, the goblins realized that no one else in the forest wanted to know the truth. So they dug and searched and asked hurtful questions, learning more about the wise princess than they had ever hoped to. But the search took its toll. The darkness was proving too much for Sister Goblin, and yet Brother Goblin kept diving deeper and deeper until Sister Goblin finally said, enough. And that was how the goblins found themselves separated again, hurt and confused, with so many unanswered questions and too many open wounds. All right, so we know that they are a product of adultery. That's where the kids were born from. Allison, wake up. this look like one of those scenes where she gotta get herself back to some type of way get herself out of this dream or whatever What? She literally fall. For real. What kind of dream was that? Oh, she's still in the dream. I thought she got out of the dream. But she's actually still in it. Monster come alive though. And find a new place for herself in this world. Where she was no longer truly a princess in a tiara and a beautiful gown. But a wan woman alone in a deep and ancient wood. This reminds me of Life is Strange. Towards the ending of, of the game. didn't show that part but we at chapter three inheritance walk through i gotta edit the video and put that uh, video up so you guys can see it on my youtube so make sure you are subscribed
subscribe to that with the bell notification. documents you need for your rental application left the file for you downstairs on the kitchen counter if you are still coming to meet d for lunch you can drop off the documents take it easy today uncle eddie p.s my famous buck up buckwheat waffles are slowly growing cold in the kitchen okay yeah because you need to figure out what happened to your freaking mother i can't even turn off the music so weak well let's go in the kitchen in before we uh, put shoes on he doesn't like this kind of attention but he really does so much for the community a letter to chef brown I need to get all that paperwork together maybe that'll help me focus and clear my head what paperwork I wish you could just change your mood as easily as a record I wish Eddie's mom could have taught me how to do this Right, we got waffles. Here's the file. Just need my ID and pay stubs. ID, okay. pay stubs. That's it. Emily, Allison, how could you do this to me? Oh wow, she just having flashbacks. Going crazy. I gotta think about something else. Focus. I, I can't really eat anything right now. ID and pay stubs. So where was your ID be at then? Oh. 
a recipe. Uh, it wouldn't be in a refrigerator. So where is her? I ain't got time to look at these. But... I so don't want to go back to the station. Not after yesterday. Must be great to feel like you belong somewhere. Anywhere. Alright, so I need ID. Keys. Open this up. My ID should be in here. Ah, here's my ID. <sighs> this place is never much more than a bachelor pad, huh? There was so much I planned to do. All those sacrifices I made. And how do you repay me? Lying to my face. You're not my child. My clan deserves better. What the heck? Oh, stop it, Allison. You have to stop torturing yourself. Just grab your pay stubs so you can get the hell out of here. So where will my pesos be? I would think they'd be... I haven't had any time to sketch lately. Uh, Allison, please. It's a damn shame. Come on, Allison. Don't start. I wish I thought shooting some hoops would help me forget all this. I wonder what Michael would think about all this. Would he even get it? I'm looking for my pastas. Wherever would they be? <laughs> Guys, you need to remember Mother, everything. Sister, we look out for each other. That's what you said. But you don't mean what you say, do you? They're just words. You left me, Allison, all alone and scared. <laughs> wrong with me it's because you didn't uh finish looking at what needs to be looked at kind of look maybe the pace ups are underneath the bed not here i mean why would they be underneath the bed they might be like on the counter Ah, uh, there they are. Yep, that's it. Wait, isn't that your? It says earning statement. Hold on, I need to go to the next page. Maybe it's underneath that. Here they are. Okay, I think I've got everything I need for the application. Where's that coming from? Where did I leave my phone last night? Now, why did it stop ringing? Would it be in the basement? Why she look like that? My dove. <laughs> Only thieves and monsters hide in the dark. in the garage hey no 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 i cannot deal with you right now what's it doing here 
Well, grab your phone. Hey, Dee. Finally. I was starting to get worried. Why didn't you pick up? Yeah, uh, sorry. I, uh, I didn't have my phone on me. Okay. Well, I just wanted to make sure we were still on for lunch. Uh, yeah, of course. I'm getting ready right now. That so? Because it kind of sounds like I woke you up. That's just how I sound. But anyways, I still have a few things to do before I can leave, but I'll be there. All right, hon. See you soon. <sighs> Get it together, Allison. Come on. Grab the file, get dressed, and head out. Or it'd be nice to make a gift for Dee. God. What? My wow. hands are still shaking. The rental? Morning. Hey, Allie. Hey. Hi, guys. What are you doing here? I, uh, brought you stuff from the office. You're a good worker. I think Tessa will come around when she's had a chance to clear her head. That's nice, Tom. Thanks. I'm gonna head on inside. Freezing my butt off out here. Okay, uh, thanks. Is Tyler not around today? Um, do I tell him that we had a fight? I mean, just say it, we had a fight. We had a fight. I think we just needed to get out of each other's hair for a little bit. I'm sorry to hear that. You were so happy he was coming home. Oh, it's okay. We'll get over it. I really hope so. <clears throat> so, Tessa told me a little bit about what happened at the cemetery. If you're going to lecture me, save it. She had it coming. She went behind Marianne's back and almost got us killed. What she did had terrible consequences, but I promise you she was trying to help. Besides, you two didn't say anything she wasn't already thinking. She spent years blaming herself. Well, she wasn't the only one involved. There was a lot of blame to go around. I'm glad you're able to see that. It seems like your brother, well, he, he's not nearly so forgiving, is he? He has been pretty harsh, especially on Eddie. But we both got tired of people lying to us for our own good. Yes, of course, uh, totally reasonable. Though, I am sorry you're the one taking all the repercussions. I heard about the fight with your uncle. I really hope your brother appreciates your sacrifices. He will. I mean, he does. I'm sorry, but I'm pretty beat. Well, let me finish the application oh, so we can keep it uh, moving. I'll let you rest. Tell Michael there's no need to hurry back. Okay. Thanks Isn't the store open? Must Bye now, have take care. People. Sorry for abandoning you out there. Pro tip? Avoid catching a ride with Tom at all cost. Did he talk about the new spicy chocolate bars? Yep. And exactly what they do to his digestion. <sighs> Who cares about that? What's up with him? You're free now. Uh, well, I don't even know what that means. What's up with him? I'm not sure I've ever seen him so eager to help. Tess has been venting nonstop about your fight. He probably needed an excuse to take a break. Plus, a uh, door-to-door -door is part of campaigning, right? Yeah, I guess. So they about to talk? Yeah, we might as well talk. So, you in here? got some sweet tips at the diner. My Juno fund's grown a shit ton lately. That's awesome. Every table waited is one step closer to freedom. You know it. Sometimes it feels like I'm crowdfunding my way out of here. All right. So. I don't know about you, but I just really need to get out of Delos Crossing. Well, we're on our way soon, right? Right. I don't know. I, I've just got this feeling it's going to fall through and, and I'm going to be stuck here forever. That's not happening. We've got a plan. 
Help yourself to some waffles if you want. That's Eddie's way of saying I'm worried about you. Oh, that's cute. But I had a ridiculously huge breakfast, so I'm good. <sighs> I'm glad you're here, Michael. Thanks for coming. Of course. When I heard what happened, I knew the bitch's grotto had to go mobile. Guess I've got plenty of time to binge the last season of Witches of Eldom now that I'm fun employed. Wait till you see how they did Mabel. You're gonna rage quit just like I did. I don't know. I've got a lot of free time ahead of me. Allison, what's going on? Uh... Tyler and I had a fight last night. I was so excited to have him back, but what if 10 years was too much and we're too different? I don't think so. You just need to get to know each other again. Start with the small shit. Figure out what each other's favorite foods are, you know? And then build up to the big stuff. Yeah, that, that makes sense. The last few days have been a lot. And it's totally okay to be overwhelmed. You're gonna figure it all out. Families are fucked up. <laughs> They're basically fuck up factories. You're right. I just need to relax. <sighs> what was that? She sighed and then she's, her mouth moved. So, so maybe this will cheer you up. I think I found the perfect place. Check it out. It's pretty cool, right? Deposit's a bit high, but it's got two large bedrooms and a view of the channel. Honey, you're really going to give up our home to live in this ugly box? <laughs> oh God. Allison, Allison, look at me. Are you okay? I'm just. Um, I need to. I, I just need to sit down. Look, your power's it's getting okay. worse if you High call five. it that. What's going on? Tell him about the memories. Let's tell him about the memories. What the heck? I mean, God, everything. My anxiety is through the roof. I can't eat anything without getting sick and... And I've been seeing things. Memories. Of Marianne and me and Tyler when we were kids and, and Eddie and... Why do you call it Mom Marianne? Why not just Mom? It used to just be stuff I'm pretty sure really happened, but... Now I see them everywhere. Shouting every shitty thought I've ever had about myself. I don't know how much more of it I can take. That's intense. I'm sorry, has... Anything like this happened to you before? Right after Marianne died, I had a lot of panic attacks, but nothing exactly like this. <laughs> Come here, Allie. Well, where is Tyler then? You. Okay, I hear you. You don't even know what to say to it. I wouldn't even you know what to say either. You must think I'm completely nuts. No. I think you went through some really bad shit. You never saw anyone about it, right? Yeah, I, I've looked into therapists a few times, but they're all so far away and so expensive. Well, you know what I went through in 2011. I don't know if I'd still be here if I hadn't gotten help. You got that money coming in from the house. For our apartment in Juno, I don't want to bail on you. Look, I know you hate letting people down, but you got to put your own oxygen mask on first. I get that. And so does Tyler. Thanks. I'll try. I really need to work on the house today, but Tyler's crashing out there. 
Not sure if I'm ready to face him. If you want, I could go out there, see how he's feeling and if he's ready to talk. What do you think? Yeah, that should work. That should yeah, work. maybe that could work. I hope he'll talk to you, though. He's never been the best at opening up to new people. You sure? Yeah, of course. I don't mind trying if it might patch things up between you two. Oh shit, I'm gonna be late for my lunch with Dee. I still need to change and stuff, but I can drop you off at the store if you want. Sure, thanks. No, Michael, thank you for listening. I mean it. All right, so we'll get to be Tyler for a moment. I'm guessing he's gonna go over there and talk to Tyler to try to burn it, to tear up the, the letters that was written. Hi, Dee. Hey, beautiful. You okay? Cause, girl, you look like shit. I, uh, haven't been sleeping well. But here I am. That's how much I love you, right? Aw. Well, I appreciate us having a girl's lunch anyway. Just give me five minutes so I can finish off this paperwork. Oh, no rush. I need to drop off some stuff with Eddie. All right. Oh, uh, help yourself to some cobbler. Mrs. Romero sent it over after I caught her flasher. It's in the break room. You better hurry before Greg's kills it off. Mrs. Romero's cobbler? I'm on it. <laughs> I'll meet you in there when I'm done with this. Uh, what kind of cobbler? Peach cobbler? Apple Morning. cobbler? Hola, Miss Ronan. Ooh, these look like wild berries. Mrs. Romero must have frozen them over the summer. Oh yes, she takes her cooking seriously. Very seriously. Alright, I guess he wants me to go upstairs. I'm gonna go upstairs. Try not to hang out upstairs too long. Chief's orders. Sorry. But she seems so young. She's the Sounds only young like person. Busy. It shouldn't bother him. Uncle's in there. Whew, he's really letting that guy have it. I wish you gonna drop the foul off it. Hey, Gregs. Hey, Allison. What brings you here today? Just needed to drop off some paperwork with Eddie. The chief's busy right now, but you could leave him in his mail slot. Ah, okay. That's why I needed to talk to him. Well, he couldn't tell me where to leave it in the mail slot. So where's the mail slot? Mr. Griffin, can you confirm the reason for your visit to Delos Cross? Well, drop it off. My folks and younger brother lives here. Where do you know? Where's the post office? I should probably drop the paperwork here. Eddie's going to be busy for a while. All right, now go have your lunch. I wonder how Uncle's feeling about me moving away. We haven't really talked about it. Should I leave now? What's good, G? How are you? I'm trying to finish up this game so I can uh, be on Battlefield next week. Hmm, <laughs> dessert for lunch. Pretty cool, right? Uh, pretty cool. Yeah. I've always had a sweet tooth. I'm doing good. Got it from my mom. She baked darn near every day. It was off I need today. to start being a little careful, though. Doctor's orders. Brenda may be in for it, too. <laughs> God, that kid can eat. Linda's pretty concerned, but, uh, growing boys, right? He needs the extra energy. He wants to let her in wrestling, and, oh boy, is he working hard. Damn. Sometimes I miss being 14. Well, eat. I'm about to say, she don't even have nothing on that spoon. <sighs> Whew. 
Hey, sorry I kept you waiting. No worries. You'll never believe it. We caught the mailbox bandit. And guess who it was? Who was it? Hmm, an animal? Like a raccoon, maybe? Have you been eavesdropping in on official police business? <laughs> I mean, anyway, I'm, yeah, I it's a raccoon. I wouldn't think it would be a person. Delos Crossing's most wanted turned out to be some trash band of stowaway. <laughs> and this is how legends begin. Anyway, hun, I'm so sorry to bail, but I gotta run this little guy to animal control now. Probably best I take a rain check. Oh, it's, it's okay. Totally, I understand. Duty calls. Thanks. Well, we need to try again soon. I feel yeah, so achievement bad about just to find day. out uh, I who the bandit was. I thought about something, but I was a little strapped for time, so. No, I get it. With your brother back, I see where your priorities are now. What? No, no, it, it's not. Relax. I'm just kidding. I really gotta go now. Look, I need to find out who their right, dad is. Right, I'll call is. you later. That's who I want to try know. to get some sleep, all right? See ya. I need that achievement. Well, get up and leave. Well, there go my lunch plans. Hey, your brother didn't tag along today? No. He didn't really want to show his face around here after the mess he made yesterday, huh? Um... Apologize. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. It got kind of out of hand. Don't worry. We know it wasn't your idea, but look. You make him seem like you. he's so bad. This isn't the Allison we know. The Allison you know? Yeah. The sweet, smart girl who'd never hurt anyone on purpose. I know you two and the chief made peace, but I gotta say, it ate at him all day. I used to be a big achievement hunter. I never was one. Um, but there are we games I have gotten to, to get platinum on. A couple of times but that was only because it wasn't um all right i just want you to be careful I've because i had majority of the time. trophies already anyway people they mostly don't change but at this point Even i got so many games to play that i just play to beat them i'm really tired can we not do this allison i like you i really do i've known you since you were a kid you're honest Stable. You're not a troublemaker. But Tyler, I mean, if he goes down, don't let him take you with him, okay? I, I can't, I can't do this. Oh, are you okay? Please just let me go. I need air. I need some air. I think I got any platinum by the time I started playing games on PlayStation. I was already out of that phase. Ty oh, okay. Okay. Tyler? Yeah, I haven't played um, games Answer in a while. Me, please. Um, I think I stopped when I was like in high school. Either high Fuck. school or middle school, Why somewhere along those me? lines. God. I can't breathe. Please stop. But when I started back, I just happen to. Um, hold on. I'll tell you in a minute. Okay. Okay. I've been here before. This will pass. Well, she had a breathe out. these people are gonna be like or when I'm gonna see you again we can still undo it we can tell them what really happened no way it's done that's it you're gonna be there to talk on the voice if I need you right of course it'll almost be like we're still together it's time to get going though come on wait chief 
Just a sec. Hey, uh, kids, I, um, went back to the house and got a few things for you. I, I know how much he's meant to you. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. Oh, kids, I... <laughs> This is just goodbye till next time, okay? <laughs> Yeah, so I stopped playing around middle school, so I really wasn't um, Allison? playing then. What are you doing until out here? Two years ago. It's freezing. I just needed some air. What but happened? I only um. What's wrong, little moose? Got platinum on Spider Man and um the Sherlock Holmes um game. I think I had a panic That's it. attack. <laughs> It's gonna be okay. Let's get you inside and warmed up. Then we can talk about what happened. Wait, how was he outside when he said he was busy? And he was talking to somebody in his office. I don't get it. 